Hey guys, tonight's video is going straight to DVD. We are not live tonight. We are uploading straight to YouTube. And we have our pizza dough here. I um, uploaded the recipe for the pizza dough. It's really simple. It's one cup of water, one package of instant um, dry yeast, and then, let's see, there's uh, one tablespoon of sugar. And then what the sugar does is it activates the yeast helps it grow, sugar helps yeast grow, um, and then there's one tablespoon of oil and a fourth teaspoon of salt. So it's really easy, you gotta use lukewarm water, and that also helps the yeast grow. And you add the yeast, and you add the sugar, and bam, yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyways, <laughs> so we're making our pizzas tonight. From the dollar store, yes. So we got our cheese, our pepperonis, and we got some black olives here. And our dough was resting all day since like 11 o'clock. So it rested all day long. And we preheated our oven to 425. And this is gonna be a fairly quick video. The thing I love about homemade pizzas is that you can make them rustic, like Italian looking. They don't have to be all perfect and everything. All right, that's enough. Okay, so I'm getting another one of these. They're just like they're just like catering lids or whatever that I'm using. I'm just gonna spray it with a little bit of nonstick spray since this isn't like a pizza oven or anything like that. I'm gonna use this over. It's gonna be such a quick video because it's so easy. So I'm just gonna go ahead our crust up, put it onto the one that has the plane on it, and it does not need to be round. It doesn't need to be circle. I like it like this. It looks cooler, a little more rustic looking, and you know what I'm going to do before I bake it? I'm going to put a little bit of granulated garlic, so bam, right over the top. And if you want and you have Italian seasoning, I got my Italian seasoning from Dollar Tree too. You can go on there with a little bit of Italian seasoning, flavor up your crust a little bit. This is gonna be a beautiful pizza. Um, this is a this is a late night dinner. We, this video is late because we got people got things to do. But anyways, can y'all see this? Let me see. Can y'all y'all can see this? Yeah, y'all see this? Beautiful. Let me do these. Let me get this here. Okay. Getting our sauce going down on here. I'm not, I don't like a lot of sauce. Colin, do you like a lot of sauce on your pizza? Lots of sauce. You like lots of sauce? Yeah. Ew. He's not like a lot, a lot, but like a decent amount. He's not my child. Yeah, I am. He's not my child. I don't like a lot of sauce. Okay, so then. I'm gonna get the olive oil. I have olive oil. If you don't have olive oil, they sell it at Dollar Tree. You can get it from there too. I'm just gonna sprinkle a little bit of olive oil on there. And uh, when I was in Italy and we made pizza, you don't sprinkle the olive oil on until the end. But you know, people kind of do things their own way. Do you want black olives, Colin? Uh-uh. No, you don't like olives anymore? I never have. Colin, you used to love olives. Yes, you did. That was me. Boy, it was you. Wait till, wait till I talk to your dad. You used to love olives. You and uh, Damien used to love olives. All right, so there we go. Now we're going to hit this with some pepperonis. Bam. Bam. Pepperoni lovers. Get it. And all this for just ten dollars at Dollar Tree. Make your own crust if you can't. If you don't have yeast, I had yeast because, of course, I'm a chef. I cook a lot. I have a lot of staple items. I have a ton of items that are my staples. So I had yeast here. But if you don't have yeast, you can make it without it. It'll be a thicker crust. It's not going to be as light and airy, but that's okay. You can still make it. I think they also have like the pre that you can pre-make yourself. 
I think they have those at the Dollar Tree. The crust mix where you just add water or whatever. And this is good for like a quick dinner, you know, a quick night. Right now, like we're run we were running late on dinner. Dad had to work late and I didn't have a car today. He had the car today. So, you know, dinner's a little later than it normally is. And when you flower your station, only just dusting. So I shook some off. I put it on there and I shook it off. And whatever stuck to this surface is enough. So I'm gonna roll out my second one. I should have put it on the other pan, the other one. That's what I should have done. And don't forget to put flour on your uh, on your rolling pin like I just did. Each time, do it each time for each pizza. But I really, I should have stuck this second one on there. They should only take between, mm, I'm gonna guess like eight and 10 minutes. I wish I had a pizza oven. Like, I would totally have a pizza oven if I could. If I get a house built, it's going to have pizza oven. It. It's going to have too much kitchen stuff in it, honestly, but that's okay, too. But our oven is on 425, so it shouldn't take more than, like, eight minutes to cook, to be honest. And rolled it out little thing. We're going to wait. We're going to wait on this one to cook. And once this one is cooked, then we'll get our next one going. But guys, this is a really, really simple dinner. There's nothing hard about this at all. So simple, you can get everything from Dollar Tree. Have a quick dinner, have pizza night. And as I told you guys before, it is National Pizza Month. October's National P Pizza Month. Um, pasta month was the other day then there are a lot of like disability awareness days happening in October there's breast cancer awareness so there's a lot of cool things there's also Halloween and then it's festive time and fall time so a lot of cool things are happening in the month of October that warrant pizza I feel like everything warrants pizza but guys this has been a short and sweet video I'm gonna come back and I'm going to add the finished product to this video so you guys can see how amazing this pizza is. Again, it's on 425 for about 8 to 10 minutes. And I'm going to let everybody get back to their normally scheduled program. So I will see you guys next time with another episode of $10 Dollar Tree Dinners. Where we will make something else amazing. We'll see what that will be. Alright, good night guys.